Well, whenever you go online, your every move is being tracked. And the big question is, what happens to all that information? Joanne Purton is here right now with advice to help you take control of your personal information, Joanne. Yeah, Stephen Glenn, and more than 60% of Americans consider unauthorized digital tracking very intrusive. That's according to a survey from Consumer Reports. But there are things you can do to keep your privacy private. It can be creepy when you search for a medical condition online and then a related ad pops up on your screen. It's called digital tracking. It's happening all the time. And we just think that companies should be uh, able in simple language to tell you what information is being collected and how it's being used. Consumer Reports' latest issue has page after page of advice for protecting your privacy. Here are four easy steps you can take to limit digital tracking. First, install an ad blocker such as Privacy Badger. It blocks ads that come with tracking software. Number two, check your phone settings to see which apps are tracking your location and turn off any that don't need to know. Number three, if you visit an unfamiliar website that demands your email, go to a site like 10minuteemail.com or you can get a functioning email that self-destructs after you use it. And finally, be cautious of Google. As you use Google, it is just collecting a tremendous amount of information about you. And it does that no matter where you go online, if you're using Google Search. Google Maps, looking at YouTube, using Gmail. You can see just how much Google tracks if you look under My Account and then My Activity. There are alternative search engines like DuckDuckGo that don't track their users. I oh, know I can't give up Google, though. <laughs> if you want to stick with your Google search, you can tweak the settings. You can delete the records of what you search and the YouTube videos you watch. We've got more Consumer Reports tips available to you on our website right now. I'm Joanne Purton, 7 Action News. Glad All right. Thanks a lot, Joe.